I'm Adam Bosen. I'm a computer engineer in my fifth year at the Rochester Institute of Technology. I think it maybe started when I was about 10. Um, my branch of engineering, computer engineering, um, you know, mostly focused on computers, obviously. Um, and my family, when I was about that age, got our first computer. It was a beat-up old 486, you know, top of the line back then. Um, but I, I loved just playing with the thing and figuring out what it could do. And my parents, you know, looked at it and was like, all right, it's just, you know, another toy, a fancy feature to have around the house. Maybe we can use it to, you know, write things. Um, but I really got into, especially like the programming of it, realizing I can make it do things. And especially I got really into video games. Um, so programming became a big thing for me for a while. And then it kind of, uh, my goals transformed from that uh, when I was in high school, uh, especially doing, um, there's an organization called First Robotics. Um, it's mentoring for high school kids. Uh, they give them a game to build a robot for and they get six weeks to build it. So it's a really intense build schedule and it teaches a lot about the practicalities of engineering. And I really realized that while I was doing that, that um, it wasn't just working with the computer that I liked so much, it was using the computer to make something in the real world actually happen. In this case, taking this robot that the rest of the team had built, um, 130 pound hulking contraption, and bringing it to life. And essentially that was my job. Aikido, it's a martial art. I'm currently brown belt in it. Um, second Q, I'm one, two belts away from getting my black belt. Um, but doing that, I think, is really helping understand, you know, movements of the body and just being able to connect with people. Accept it, embrace it. Just know that you know these things and you really want to learn and it's really what you're passionate about. And if you just show that to people, it's very hard for them to tear you down for it. I want to do, I've already got the computer engineering almost in the back. I've got two quarters left at school. Um, and then after that I want to do more, I want to get my PhD in neuroengineering. Um, so I want to advance that, but as to how I want to use that, I'm not sure. So it's still something that's constantly evolving. It's an idea I think about a lot and really work on.